Hi, it's Brendan here again with another way to make an impact on your training and your coaching this year, right now, instantly. And we, we, we covered your purpose and your goal very clearly in the last session. This one is all about, I'm going to challenge you and ask you, are you training with intent in your programs or as a coach, personal trainer, athletic development or strength and conditioning professional, are you creating the intent from your athletes and clients? So are they going through your program with enough intent in every single session? Because let me tell you this, if you can engage those athletes and those clients to really put 100% into your sessions, it doesn't matter what program they're doing, they will get better results instantly from that. All right, now here's a three-step method on how to do this, and I'm going to credit my friend and colleague Nick Ward for this, because I think it's a really cool model. It's a three-step method. I call it the 3E method. I'm going to ask you right now, are your programs exciting? Okay, are they exciting to you or your athletes? All right, because if they're not, how can you ever get that intent and that purpose and that real drive and passion into your programs? You can't. So step number one, are they exciting? Step number two, are you as a coach really engaging with your athletes? Are you giving them the purpose? So if your session might look really exciting on paper, really cool, now as a coach it's our job to say, this is why we're doing it, this is what this is about, this is why you've got to give me your all. And finally, the final E is, are you now enabling your athletes. Are you coaching them? Are you doing the right things as a coach? Saying the right things. Sometimes saying nothing is better than saying something. So three E's there. Are you exciting people with your sessions? Are you then engaging them and giving them the why, the purpose? Are you then enabling them with your coaching and your cues and your language and your energy and intensity? And I think really any kind of struggles that we're having as coaches can be traced back to a flaw in one of those three E's. It's so simple. Is it exciting enough? Is it really getting us to think, wow, I want to do this session? Because that's key. Is it, in, it, are we engaging then and say, and giving people the purpose? Do, we under, do our athletes and clients understand why? And finally, are we coaching? Are we enabling people through our coaching? All right, so session number two in, on this ways to make an impact is all about intent in training. And it really is about power work, speed work, even mobility work, your warm-ups, your cool-downs. Every component of your training must be done with intent. And your athletes must understand why they're doing it to give that back. Okay, when we talk about athletes not doing enough in training, I think we, if, we point one, if we point the finger, look where the other... Three are pointing back right at me. As a coach, it's my responsibility to get that response from my clients and athletes. Okay? So today, I want you to think about how you can get more intent in your training for yourself and for your clients and for your athletes, guys. And the results will come, I promise you. Thanks for listening.